covers the deploy functionality of the Factory Talk Policy Manager. So Factory Talk Policy Manager contains a model of the security configuration for devices. This information resides on a server using services. Now that information eventually needs to get to the actual devices themselves and that's where deploy comes into play. So to get the, this information to devices, the user needs to click on the deploy button. And when they do, they are given a list of all the devices that will be deployed to. And they can scroll through that list to see information. And they can click on more details to get more details of exactly which devices will be deployed to and what kind of security configurations will be deployed to that device. All of this information is just a copy of what is in the model, but it's just a reminder to the user of everything that will be touched during this deploy. The user has two options for deployment. One is that they reset device communication during policy deployment. Or the other is that they do it afterwards. This is important because the security configuration will reside on a device, but it won't be active until the communications are reset on that device. So the user can do it during policy deployment, which means when deployment is over, it will now be communicating using the secure configuration. If it's done after deployment, it will continue to communicate using its uh, non-secure communication, but once it naturally resets on its own, or the user goes out into the field and manually resets communications, uh, that at that point it will then start communicating securely. So the user makes a choice there, and then they can click on deploy. When they click on deploy, then the information of deployment will show up here. And I'll let the user know about successes and failures of their deployment. Deployment is occurring, the results will show up in the results pane as shown here. And then when a deployment is complete, there will be a summary report showing you how many ports failed to receive deployment, and listing out those ports, and then the errors that occurred, and any warnings. The user can collapse and show those. And then there's a status of how many were successfully deployed to, how many were deployed to with a warning, and how many failed deployed. And as you can see in this instance, uh, it was totally it was not successful at all, and all failed deploy. But it was successful. You'd see those successes too listed, and the warnings also listed. This can be saved by clicking on the save icon. You can save it to your desktop, so you can have a report of your deployment saved. And that covers deployment using Factory Talk Policy Manager.